Cheryl, how do you meet each other? Um, when, when are you dating? When you decide to get married? Okay, I met Philip through my mother, believe it or not. He came and my mom, he knew my mother, so one day he came knocking on the door because my mom invited him for lunch. So I said, Mommy, there's a gentleman to see you. His name's, he says, I'm Philip. I come for lunch. And from that day, he fell in love with me from heads over heels. We were both, I think we connected. It was like love at first sight. And after two, three months, we were planning our wedding. And it was, it was, it, it was like 40 years ago, 41 years. I met him through my mother. Never had one day of regret, never in my life. If God said to me, sure, would you like your, I said, I can have it all over back again as it was, with all my ups and downs, but I'll never change him for the world. I'm very happy with my life. The best gift God has ever given me. <laughs> You're lucky. I'm lucky. You're telling me I'm lucky. <laughs> same question to, to Philip, maybe. Yeah. Hear a different side. Different side of the when I saw her, I thought, where did this beautiful girl come from? When she opened the door, I was stunned. I opened it with my mouth. <laughs> like this. Because she's a beautiful woman. Uh, and then she was a beautiful girl. I don't she's getting old now. <laughs> But still, she's beautiful <laughs> in my eyes. Yes, sir. How did you know she was the one? The way I felt, never felt like this before in my life. Yeah. Never felt this way in life. Yeah, we Love knew it. we belonged to each other. We just knew it. And then that was it. So after a few months wedding, We had George, my eldest son. I think it was after about no a year afterwards. George was born because George is thirty-eight or two years, thirty for two years. I mean Raymond. And uh, we had a big gap between the two. I think it's four years. Because Philip, you know, was doing. You know, we we That's wanted to plan our family. We had now lost a child in between Raymond and George. Uh, them, and I had Raymond. And he was born one month too early, but he's a beautiful kid. Then I lost another child in between them. And then I had Roxanne, the most wonderful, beautiful children. My kids actually looked after us for nearly 10, 10 how long have you been on dialysis now? 10 years? 15. 15. It was since he got sick, when we stopped our business, uh, because we never had uh, medical insurance. So my kids looked after us. They looked off, they've been looking after us for the last 15 years. All three of my kids, they support us. They look after us, they pay our rent. Put him on dialysis for one year till he qualified to become onto the medical aid on uh, Spectrum Med. So my kids have always looked after us. I was blessed. I've been blessed with wonderful children. They support us. And they all they take after. When they do bad, they take after their father. When they do good, they <laughs> just like them. That's how it works. Okay. I'm entitled to say something like that. <laughs>